Right, this is Avignon to Marseille. Uh, dovetail. It's the TGV duplex. And just for the purpose of mirroring, it's on the Avignon Marseille to Avignon route. Right. Good afternoon, driver. You'll be driving this express passenger service from here to Marseille Saint Charles. Open the doors to allow passengers to board and alight before departing. So our instructions go to Avignon, we're at Avignon at the moment, Exxon, Provence and Marseille. Mmm, Fantastic. Reminds you of London Faversham. Well, it's got the same signalling system, it's got the TVM430 signalling system. Put it in forward just for the giggles. Hey Rubin, your friend wants to know if there'll be advanced startup for the TSW locos. That, sir, you'll have to find out. As and when there's any news on that. There's nothing been announced about that at the moment. It's called British Summertime Flames because it applies during the summertime. Got a horn. We has a horn. We has two horns. See you later, stuff nuggets. What we need though is a screenshot, isn't it? Unfortunately, it sort of looks like most of the other screenshots. That's not too bad of a screenshot, actually. Right, it's time to depart for Marseille Saint Charles. I got points for doing that. I didn't even do anything. Why isn't there a single level TGV version? Because that's another train to be developed. That's a completely different train. Why have we got Trois Rouge? That means we've got to stop. Yeah, Just Train's got the first French route out. Well, now we've got 130. It's our first French route, though, isn't it? <laughs> I mean, Just Train's weren't even the first with the French route out. There have been other people with French routes out. But it's the first, this is the first one that we've done. One seventy, right? It's time to get some speed up. Flames. We are doing an American route after this. Two twenty.
You got 948 rib key, well done. 160. Back up to 220. This is for that train that we're following in front of us. What other countries from Europe would I like to see in the game? I'd like to see all of them. <laughs> I'm certainly not going to be picky. Yeah, the guy, if I've got the green screen already set up, um, Laurie, it will do it automatically. Nope, you can only sound one on the horns at a time. Is the FL9 the new or F7? It, it looks like an F7, yeah, and it's it's the one that's the Metro uh, the Metro North in New York, New Haven colours. Seventy. We're starting to catch up with the train in front a little bit now, I think. 67 to Axon Provence, though. No, this doesn't hang around. 300 kilometers an hour at the moment. We're about to get boosted to 320 kilometers an hour. No kilometres per hour, lorry. Oh, two seventy again. Radio the train in front and tell them just get a move on. Yeah, really. <laughs> hey, Steve, welcome. You all right, sir? If you're not aware of it, Steve, there's a. Are you aware of Flight Angels? Um, the flight sim charity stream that's going on tomorrow. Flight-angels.com. Oh, they did get in touch, good.
Oh, yeah, accelerating and braking at the same time. Oh, no, it shouldn't be. It throws off. <laughs> or at least it is for me, anyway. Here are passionate French trains. Nice, Roosevelt. Welcome to the stream. That was the other day, wasn't it, Stephen? Someone said, um, um, someone said that uh, I can't remember how it even came up, and I just said, uh, "Oh, go and say hello." <laughs> The lighting as that went past. Is this route part of the route of the real Repasse to Paris line? Yeah, I think it is. It's actually two, so um, up here the route splits off, and one of them I think maybe goes to Paris, Montpellier, and Valence. So that's probably Montpellier, I guess, ultimately goes to Paris. I don't know. Wow, make your mind up, train. Do you want two thirty or three twenty? later and later and later. <laughs> Come on train in front, get out of my way. Are we going to Crete, WT? Nice. Three to five O's a write off, is it? Yeah, it doesn't surprise me. Roosevelt, thank you for the follow, much appreciated. Rubku says this line's to the north, goes to Lyon and Paris to Brussels. There you go, folks. Apparently, the train in front has found the accelerator pedal, so we're all good. Going uphill now. Is it possible to so delay the dispatch against priority to another train? No, the game can't do that. The game will, will always consider that if it's your turn to go, then you'll you'll be given. flat out and we're just losing time <laughs> it's a go via though so it's not a yeah but still that's four minutes four minutes which one do I think is better London Faversham 
Mas I have a new no Chengdu Sining and London Faversham, we're not shadow of a doubt. And the reason for that is because of um, the variety on the um, London Faversham route. There's a bit of high speed, there's a bit of um, sort of commuter style stop start running. There's some unfortunately WT again that's something I can't talk about really at the moment. Two seventy. Are oh, you on the car? You got this in the pioneers, did you? Nice one. What's up, WT? Uh, WT, as I said a minute ago, that's something unfortunately I can't. That's one one bit I can't talk about at the moment. Or well, one of the many bits I can't talk about. Mostly because actually I don't know the answer to that one. That one's a tricky one. Assets via workshop is a tricky one. Because people can break trademarks, break copyrights, and do all sorts of things by it when they upload their own assets. But they can't really do that quite so much with a route or a scenario. Steve Giverton, yeah, to be honest, you ain't seen anything yet. <laughs> it does, I mean, it does look stunning, it really does. Shazam, that's actually a myth um, that trademarks can be used as long as people aren't making money from it. But I don't know if maybe that's okay in the US. It's from talking to a lawyer friend in the UK, it's not okay in the UK. It's just they generally don't prosecute it quite so much. Because, you know, there's not much benefit for it. It's a lot of effort and not a lot but not a lot of benefit, so Laurie, um, without making any promises, I will say that we've got uh, in part of our engineering team using 750Ti's. And like I said, it doesn't run fabulously, but it runs. In fact, the artist who built the loco, well, um, two of the locos that are in there, he's actually running it on a 650Ti, and that's quite painful. Oh, we seem to have gained a bunch of time from somewhere. I 
like I said, Laurie, I, I don't consider that a promise, but that, that's certainly where we're at at the moment. The if engineer Spectrum 48. <laughs> Two kilometers to Axon Provence means that sites on uh, these guns on sites like DBC are technically illegal. Unless they've got permission. If they've got permission, then they're not. I mean, I don't know if they've got permission, and I'm not going to assume that they don't have permission. That wouldn't be right either. But suffice to say, if you've got a Virgin livery Reese game, then you need to have permission from Virgin to have it. And uh, we don't, so that's why we don't do it. Those that do, hopefully they have permission. <laughs> Right, we are now on the descent, so that it sort of goes up over this bump and then we, we dive down into Marseille. But neither DTG nor Valve will be responsible for copyright problems on Steam Workshop. Um, enabling copyright violation to take place can be, um, you know, that can, that can be a, uh, a thing. But there's also the fact that we also don't necessarily want to be responsible for helping people break the law, bluntly. So if they find their own way to do it, then that's fair enough. But uh, us actually providing a mechanism for people to do it is that's different. Yep, there's a passenger view. Quite a nice passenger view, actually. One thirty. Not to worry too much, actually. One thirty in a minute. DCG broke the law by hiring me. How 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 do you feel that, out, hey, Ruben? <laughs> FV sixty three. I've I've had X X and X as told to me as being the the God's honest truth as the definite way of pronouncing it. So <laughs> I don't have a clue. All I know is that it's definitely not aches, which is how I started out pronouncing it. So, at least it's moved forward in some small way. Oh, well, never mind drive quality. Peachlick, the thing is, you don't know what's been going on in the background. You know, whether or not um, there are problems um, that the SCS have been dealing with silently. You don't know whether or not um, it's just too small and nobody cares. Uh, WT, Matt, you're out of sync on the stream. Hello, is, what does everyone else think? Is, am I all okay? Let me know, folks. Not that, to be honest, there's not a lot I can do about it, but... Eighty as we come down through the bottom, we switch back over to... Uh, away from TVM's... Um, Alright, 160 limit. Lips are not syncing with the video. Have you tried refreshing WT just to see if 
It's just the um, the player that's the problem. Dave, I am not changing. All right, here we go. Is that better? Do you prefer that? How do you, what do you think of that, Dave? Have I nailed it? <laughs> I need to change this over. I can't remember which one it is. Not that one. That one. Much better. Not you as well, Arnold. Well, peace, Nick. I'm not going to. What I'm not. I'm not saying what's going to. What is and isn't going to happen going forwards. I'm just explaining why um, it hasn't happened to date. I don't think any decisions been made about what we can and can't go you know, do going forwards. Uh, Woody, um, I really. Uh, to be honest, I'm not sure I see the benefit of streaming to, to two streaming systems. You'd need you double the amount of moderation work. You double the amount of. Um, yes, you get a wider audience, but you've got two different communities rather than having one. And part of building Twitch is building a community. And what would more likely happen is that what you'd do is you'd start off by taking the Twitch community, dividing it in half, and then some people saying, "Well, I prefer it on YouTube, and I prefer it on. Um, uh, I prefer it on Twitch." So instead of getting more people, what you actually end up with is half as many people on this and half as many people on the other plus extra work so I don't know at the moment I don't see the point in dual streaming yeah that was the pantograph settings because uh, we came off of the uh, the LGV line essentially at the moment uh, Laurie I'm streaming at um, 720p um, when I'm on YouTube I stream at 1080p 60fps which is glorious And as Dave says, once you get once you get partnership, if we ever get partnership, I'm sure we will. Um, but once you get partnership, you have to do all your video game streaming with Twitch. You can't split. Wow! I was watching the needle, and it didn't do anything. Trying to slow the train down and uh, not forgetting you need more CPU usage. Oh, I'm not too fussed about that. I mean, using OBS Studio, I am streaming at 720, recording at 1080, and I am. Um, um, Uh, it's only using 7% of the CPU. So OBS Studio is just nothing short of epic in that, um, as far as that's concerned. So yeah, I'm already dual streaming essentially because one of the streams is a 20 megabit um, 1080p stream that I'm recording. Which is so that I use that now for uploading to YouTube rather than taking the Twitch stream. Which is much better. I didn't enable KVB before we started. I think that's why KVB isn't there, and I think it might have confused it. A cantilever stand? Is that not what I've got? Boom arm thing, this thing. Um, I tried putting it above me, and it won't. Unless I move it to where I am. It, um, when I drop it down, because it's quite, a, let me hold it up, it's quite a big microphone. Yeah, if I lift it up um, and drop it down, you can see it up there, uh, and I can't lift it up high enough.
Look at that score penalty going up. That's crazy. That dropped to 30. I didn't even know that was dropping to 30. <laughs> What's my bitrate set to at the moment? 3 megabits because we've got transcoding. <sighs> I'm watching chat at the moment. <laughs> Ab oh, let me do the follow, hang on. Do it the proper way. There you go. Oh, no. Admiral Tacos, thank you for the follow, much appreciated. Oh, the medal medal's already gone. I'm surprised to get anything tonight. <laughs> I was for a little while stunned, simply staring at the uh, the score going down as fast as it was. It's like, wow, that's pretty epic. Oh, that's nice. Oh, that's nice. That's lovely. All right, why are you why are you stopping me? Right, we have requested for mass signal at danger. Signalman's um, asleep. Thirty limit. If we don't have transcoding, I drop the bit rate to two to two megabit. I think 2 megabit provides a decent. Um, did that say denied? Well, it didn't bang me out if I, because it should have um, um, ended the scenario. Why is it on emergency brake all of a sudden? Oh, I'm going over there, aren't I? <laughs> No, I'm coming left. So he wasn't in my path. Oh, I need to be going up here. Oh. Oh. That's not going to work now, is it? Oh, that's why I keep hitting the emergency setting. That's why the emergency brake keeps coming on. That slip is wrong. Or is it now going the right way? Oh, it's going the right way. It did eventually get there. Route wasn't set. Yeah, I know. Chalk it up to a little bit of impatience, I think. I need some more iron brew. That's it, you got it. I need to get the notching for this one set up on my rail driver because at the moment I can't reuse the rail driver with this one. Well, I don't know sure how I can be late given that um, literally the point just changed. I mean, the game can tell me I'm late all at once, but I might not care too much. Will I be talking about TSW again? Um, yeah, there's going to be regular um, things coming out um, from uh, from Dovetail about TSW. What do you mean, where is Adam? Um, he sits next to me at work. As of where he is right now, I've got no idea. Doing stuff that isn't work, I presume. Who's having issues uploading to Workshop, Arnold? You were six seconds on time. Well, how come I was late then?
Yeah, it's all open plan office, um, Woody. Oh dear, oh dear. Will we get a positive score? Will we get a positive score? That's all I'm looking for at the moment. Just a positive score. How do you notch the RD? Um, I've, again, it's all custom scripting that I've written to do the notching. Iron brew. Brew. Ooh, we got another three. Wow, we got six, six, nine. How do we get six, six, nine? You hope that's Pepsi. Pepsi? Actually, I like Pepsi. Oh, yeah. Excellent. What do we get anyway? 669. Well, that's rubbish. But you know what? <clears throat> I didn't think we were going to get anything else, to be honest. I, th I thought we were going to get a zero. So I'm quite amazed that we got 669. <laughs> Okay, right, connecting at Yankee time. <laughs>